Yeah, all right, fuckers and fuckettes. This video exists because uh, I was reading a thread the other night, and somebody was saying that you cannot install the Tails operating system to anything but USB devices. Well, I call bullshit. And what I've done here is I've made a permanent install for one of my laptops. Boom. No, nothing USB. Boom. Just a little stupid... Uh, Hard drive hanging off of there. Let's hit the back of this thing. Boom. No USB sticks anywhere. And as you can see, the USB stick down there is not there. I'm going to pull that out. I'm going to put it right there so y'all can see that shit. It's not going anywhere. I'm going to turn this machine on real quick. <clears throat> And this is, uh, the kid had asked in a forum, could he install Tails to a um, laptop permanently? And I've done this in the past. So, I'm going to show you that it does work. I'm not going to show you how. The only reason I'm putting up this video is because the first guy that responded to this poor kid, I mean, in his own blogs, he admits that he works for DOJ. And, uh, hey, guess what? This little drive might be slower than all fuck coming up. Let me hit enter there. It's only a 5400 RPM laptop drive. It's in an older machine. Um, and you want to know my secret? That right there. And a copy of fucking, um, copy wipe. I did have to play with some options. I'm not going to show you how to do that because there's too many people using tails that are criminally inclined and I don't want to help them. But, um, for those of you with legitimate purposes for having it on your laptops, you just want some privacy or something, the point of this video is to say, hey, yes, it can be done. Let's let that shit come up. Here it comes. Like I say, this drive is slower than hell. It's an old 5400 RPM mechanical drive. If I was going to do it on a permanent laptop or something, I'd, you know, put it on an SSD, but... Give it a minute or two, it might eventually come up. is working. No, I don't want any extra options. Just log me the fuck in. I'll be fucking damned. It works. So, like I said, the point of this entire uh, video is to show you that yes, it can be done. Um, and I'm going to link it in the comments on that uh, particular. There's no DVD, there's no USB stick here. So, you know, there's no fucking DVD in it. <laughs> That's the utility that I used. It's copy wipe. You can download it for free. You do have to play with the options. Like I say, I'm not going to help the fuck-ups, the criminally inclined, so I'm not going to show you how, but I am going to call bullshit on the guy who said it cannot be permanently installed on a machine. It can be. And I noticed in the comments behind the DOJ guy that everybody was focusing on the installer doesn't support anything but USB. 
well gee you can clone a USB drive to any other drive you want okay that ends my rant I mean, they were just parroting the first guy um, there are ways to do things any any lock can be picked if you've got the right tools and the right touch we'll holler at y'all fuckers and fuckheads later